Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for Monday, March 5th. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Steady, stable, secure, practical, responsible. Wise. Four of Swords. This could be a man in your life. It could be you. Could be a father. Could be a boss. Somebody that is very mature and secure. Four of Swords. The Empress and the Two of Cups. There could be some sort of reconciliation on the horizon. A reconciliation or a new beginning after a period of Recuperation or healing. Or soul searching. Maybe somebody has gone through a period of time where they have done their inner work and now it's time for this reconciliation that... has been missing in their lives. Maybe there's been a the missing piece, okay? Maybe the missing piece is coming is coming back, okay? Maybe it's coming coming to light. Maybe it's finally coming, all right? It looks like there's been a time of recuperation here. There's been a time of recuperation that someone needed. I needed this time. I needed this time out. I needed this time to work on myself. I needed this time to be my own advocate and get to this place of serenity and peace so that I would be ready to be your partner, okay? Because there's some sort of partnership here after a time of rest, okay? A time out, a time out. So I think that there was some inner work that needed to be facilitated. And now the, the time has come for you to receive the, 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 the success that you have worked so hard to obtain. I want to get this zoomed in. Oh, it's zoomed in pretty well, isn't it? So, there is some sort of forward movement. Okay, something is changing. There's some kind of victory. There's some kind of triumph. Okay, there is. There's a triumph here. There's a victory after a timeout. There's been a timeout where... Someone needed to think, they needed to, to figure out what they really wanted, where they were going, who they were, you know. There was a period of soul searching so that they could take the most practical approach. What's the most practical thing for me? And it feels as though while someone was working on grounding themselves and getting practical and doing their inner work, things were moving behind the scenes, okay? Something was going on behind the scenes while you were working on yourself, all right? 
and it appears that there could be some sort of union on the horizon that uh, involves unconditional love. Okay, and it's because you have taken the work to love yourself unconditionally, like this Empress does. Okay, this Empress. Uh, resembles the sign of Taurus and, and this represents the sign of Taurus as well. So, so many of you could be dealing with a Taurus. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, we have Taurus here and we have Cancer right here. Okay. So what I, I'm just telling you was this, you could be dealing with any sign. So don't hold it to that. And I have to remind you that these energies are fluid. Timing is fluid. So this could be the beginning of a union, the beginning of a new partnership, the beginning of love, or it could be a reconciliation after a timeout, after you have taken the time to figure out what you really want. Because somebody has done some serious soul searching, okay? And now their soul has reached a level where they're ready to move forward towards their soulmate, okay? Somebody ha is moving forward towards their soulmate after a time of rest and recuperation because they needed to get their head right. They needed to get practical. They, need to take, they needed to take the responsible approach and come up with a plan that allows their soul to be where it needs to be. So it appears to me that today is the beginning of a beautiful union. Which leads to victory in success. And it leads to victory in success because the inner work has been done. And this reading is going to be a little bit longer because I was planning on getting a couple of other cards. But I needed these clarifiers, you see. It feels to me like your prayers have been answered. The angels have been working behind the scenes. They've been hearing your prayers. They've been divinely guiding you this whole time. They've seen your faith and trust in them, and now you're taking the next step. Fours are angels, threes, your prayers have been answered, sevens are the divine connection, and twos are the faith and trust. I just did a little bit of numerology for you. The angels have heard your prayers, and now there is forward movement. Something is moving forward in regards to your love, to your partnership. And it leads to security and stability. Look to your inner strength. You are stronger than you realize. I'm just going to get my book for this one. I hate to go in front of you guys, but I'm going to. Um, and we're still going to get one more because that's what I want to do. I feel as though we were working, or you were working on your inner foundation. I was working on me. And now I'm ready. Now I'm ready to open up. I've mastered my emotions. I've taken the time. And now it looks like there's very, very uh, aggressive movement towards your love, towards your soulmate. Ooh, and there's passion, too. 
Resurrect a childhood dream. Let your passion take flight. This could be somebody that you were, uh, grew up with or you went to school with. Somebody that you knew from your childhood. Eleven. This is something you've manifested. You have manifested this dream come true during your time out. During your recuperation, during your soul searching, you have been calling in your soulmate. And now it appears to me like you are headed towards your soulmate, or they are headed towards you. Very, very quickly, aggressively. And you may have known this person when you were younger. Doesn't mean you dated them. You know them from your childhood. Look to your inner strength. You are stronger than you realize. The angels are asking you to dig deep inside of your inner self. The strength is in you. Though it may not feel like it right now, you will be able to push through this. Believe in yourself and know that you have the power within you. And this is exactly what has happened. You have taken the time out to find your inner power. I already discussed this. To find your inner strength. To get your head right. To get where you need to be. And for the ones of you that have done this work, things are moving forward very rapidly towards your soulmate. If you are in a relationship now, there could be a reconciliation or a resurgence in a relationship. But for those of you that are single and have done the inner work, your soulmate is coming very, very quickly. And this person is someone that you have manifested through your time out. And I believe that this is per somebody that you know. Whether it's in this lifetime or not. This is somebody that you know. Some of you have not done the inner work. This card is saying it's time. Do you want this? Do you want this? Do you? You need to get here and here to have this. You need to get secure. You need to be responsible. You need to be practical. You need to be your own advocate. And you need to love yourself unconditionally. Take the time you need to reevaluate and recuperate. That's the most practical thing to do. When you take the time to do that, you will be and find the love of, the love of your life. Look to your inner strength. You are stronger than you realize. For some of you, you are about to go through a transformation that brings your soulmate to your life. It has to, I, it has to come. It, for many of you, it's somebody that you, from your childhood that you have always dreamed about. Because I said, I think I said dreams earlier. If I didn't, I was thinking it. It's like this is a dream coming true.
So anyway, what I have for today is new life. New life. Talk to you later.